obviously the city doesn't need any introduction. New York is a very important place. Really happy to be back. I love the city. Always been a, a good place for me in the past. There are six races remaining, so a lot of points to be distributed. This is round 10, the ABB New York City e -Prix. Pretty good start from Cassidy. Sweeps across immediately to cover the inside. John Eric Byrne, the two-time champion in second place. Come on, Ben. And there's the attack from Byrne. They bang wheels, and Gunter says thank you very much. Max Gunter is looking set to win it. He's out in the lead. Max Gunter through the final corner. The checker flag falls for BMW and Andretti. John Eric Byrne in second. We just missed out on pole position with Jean Eric, and unfortunately, we just missed out on the race win as well, finishing a very nice P2. What's really important is we took great points for the team's championship. Lots to look forward to tomorrow. We're just going to go out there, see what we can do. New York, New York, so good, we race it twice. This is round 11 of 15 in the FIA Formula E World Championship. And we go green in New York City. Jean-Éric Verne has not started the race. Massive commiserations for Jean-Éric Verne. Just seems to go from bad to worse. The cost has managed to get himself up into fourth place fairly quietly, really, but he's done a good job as the reigning champion. The cost are using his fan boost, coming down the back straight, and he goes to the inside, gets on the dirty stuff, and Nick Cassidy closed the door. And here it is, what's happened to Mitch Evans? Antonio Felix da Costa's got him in a third out of absolutely nowhere. <laughs> Through the final corner, check and flag falls. Sam Bird and Jaguar win in New York City and take the lead of the championship. Cassidy finished in second in the end. Antonio Felix da Costa in third place. 